Welcome back to another episode of History in Your Own Backyard. I'm your host, Susie Selleck, here today in Cincinnati, Ohio, at the base of Eden Park. I'm at a very special structure here in Cincinnati, the Elsner Arch. Stay tuned, I'll tell you all about it. The Elsnore Arch, also known as the Elsnore Tower, was constructed in 1883 for the Cincinnati Waterworks. It's reported to be inspired by the Elsnore Castle, featured in Hamlet. In 1883, the Cincinnati Waterworks wanted to extend its efficient water supply main tunnel 185 feet to the line at Gilbert Avenue. This efficient main started at the reservoir in Eden Park. To control the flow of water at the base of the steep hill, a valve house was needed. And because of the waterworks wanting to enhance the landscape of the park and wanting a structure that would also serve as a new entrance to the park, they felt that the valve house needed to have a special design. So that spring, Cincinnati was host to the Shakespearean Dramatic Festival at Music Hall. The highlight of the festival was the performance of Hamlet on Friday evening, May 4th. Many in the crowd that night were highly impressed with the stage sets, especially the opening scene. This particular stage set was a 65 by 65 foot painting of Elsnore Castle, also known as Kronberg Castle where the moody Denmark prince walked at night and spoke with the ghost of his father. In the audience that night was the waterworks superintendent, A.G. Moore. He was so impressed with the painting of Elsnore Castle that the following Monday morning, he appeared at the offices of Samuel Hannaford and Sons, an architectural firm, with a newspaper illustration of the Elsnore stage set. So what resulted was Charles B. Hannaford, the son of Samuel, was commissioned to design the valve house in the form of the Elsnore Castle. The Elsnore Tower was built later that year for a cost of $15,000. The Norman Romanesque Revival Mini Castle consists of a cylindrical tower joined to a smaller square tower by an archway. Since the Cincinnati Art Museum officially opened in 1886, a flight of steps were placed behind the Elsinore Tower as a shortcut to the museum in Eden Park. It is reported that the reservoir valves were housed in a vault underneath the tower and that the Cincinnati Waterworks uses the Elsinore Tower for equipment storage now. Thank you for watching another episode of History in Your Own Backyard. I'm your host, Susie Selleck. Hope you enjoyed your time with us today here in Cincinnati, Ohio, at the base of Eden Park at the Elsner Arch. Remember, travel slowly and stop often. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.